I was a 20-year-old, scared-to-death child. I had spent eight hours in a car with two officers transporting me from the county jail that I was in, in Northern California, and was driven down to Southern California. It was the last eight hours of my life. Within the first month of my being on the yard, I was actually sold by my roommate to another girl down the hall in a poker game. I later was attacked by two women and held down and raped. I thought I was alone. Only much later did I realize that I was one in 200,000 people who were sexually abused in detention every single year. After I served my 29 years, I never thought I'd go back to prison, but today I am. I work at Just Detention International and our mission is to end sexual abuse and detention and to make sure that prisoners get the help they need while they serve time. I'm good. Coming back in to try yeah. to help your sisters that are left yeah. behind. It and doesn't get any better than that. And I agree. I mean, and the same to you. So JDI has helped us in so many ways. And the difference with JDI is that they come in and they go the next step. It's not just assistance. It's training, education that ends up changing the culture of the institution. I lived on a unit of 120 people. This was my cell. There was 119 other broken women who coped with their issues their way. I don't know of any woman in the 29 years that I did here that hadn't been abused in some sort of way. We're bringing this in so that we can be better. So that when I walk out of these gates and I have a trigger, something that I remember from the past that may have made me melt down any other time, I have a toolbox now. I have, you know, I've talked this through. I've worked through this. I have someone I can call. I know that I'm okay. Shocking enough, we didn't know. We had rights and, you know, and Just Attention International brought those rights to us. Tomorrow is back to work. Tomorrow is Just Attention International. Wilshire Boulevard, get more packets out to survivors. It's back to to try and help the ones that I didn't get to see today.